All right, guys, uh, here we are again. Um, got the surfaces of the block all cleaned up, very nice. Got uh, the gasket set down on there. I got this uh, passenger side head set down, bolts slid in. Head bolts, where are they? Here and here will need to be slid into the head before you sit the head down. You will not get them in otherwise. Um, that and the exhaust down there, um, I had to support it with a jack and lift it up into place where it should be to get the studs slid down in it from the manifold in the head. Um, otherwise, it's kind of difficult to do. Uh, so those are the two things that will probably help you out when putting yours back together if you're following along and doing this as well. Um, but yeah, I got the manifold swapped onto it and got it set in there. Uh, just continue watching and we'll get this thing wrapped up. All right, guys, here's another update. Got both heads torqued down, uh, timing cover or timing chains and everything installed. Uh, the front cover bolted on. Uh, I'm about to put valve covers on with new gaskets. Yeah, that's where we are right now. But uh, still got that stack, stack of parts over there. That's all the parts we got left to install. So shouldn't be much longer. Uh, but it's not been a bad install, really. It's been relatively easy. But I'm super excited to get it uh, buttoned back up and all together and uh, see if I can feel a difference. But I'll be back with another update here shortly. All right, guys, another update. Uh, we got the intake mounted on there, valve covers on there. We, really don't have, we don't have very many more parts left over there. Mostly just uh, accessories and pulleys to mount on there. And uh, some harness to route. And I've got a fuel rail to mount. And uh, that's about it. Besides a couple coolant hoses, really. Yeah, but I'm getting excited. I'm ready to go test this thing out. And uh, yeah, I'll be back when we just about got it done. Hey guys, uh, here we are back with the final update of the actual installation process of PI heads. Uh, I've got it all back together now. Get the hood open. I'll show you. There we are, all back together with it. Um, this will be the final video of the actual tear down and installation process of the PI swap. I'll have some more shorter videos coming up. Um, basically going over the uh, any kind of performance improvements that it made, uh, the tests I'm taking and making to uh, just kind of see uh, what, kind, what all I gained from it. But uh, I'll have more videos on this car coming up. Uh, hopefully gonna be coming out with videos more frequently and doing some cool things with it. But thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe.